melting and the cheese is just like mixing together oh, it smells so good This is exactly the way that you want it. Mm. Just like this. And then we just want to start to scoop it all into our baking dish. You just have this one stop shop here for mm our mac and cheese and it makes it so easy just to make for an entire big party you don't have to worry about much and it's a super easy cleanup honestly like the best way for a large party so just like that, we're just scooping it all in here. Look at how creamy that is. Oh, that looks so good. And you know what? I'm gonna take a little bit more of this black pepper. I'm gonna put that right there, right on top. Look at that. And then here I have a little bit more cheddar cheese. Cheese is alive. Mac and cheese, we gotta cheese it up. We're just gonna layer that right there on top. Look at all of that cheese. Mm. Yes. So, so good. And I'd say once you get a nice solid layer of cheese on top, just like that, all we need to do is stick it in the oven. We're gonna pop it in at 350 for about 20 minutes. Oh my gosh, wait and see how good it is. Wow, this turned out absolutely amazing. Look at how creamy it is. 
Ooh, I did let it cool down just a little bit, but really, <gasps> look at that. Wow, that looks so good. I love a good little crispy outer cheese part. It smells delicious. It was super easy, easy to clean up. Everything was clean. It all turned out perfectly. I hope you guys enjoy this. Let me know what you think. Mm, delicious.